It's time for San Diego's own Approved Home Pro Show, your friends in the home improvement business. Kogo is proud to welcome your hosts, Linda Martin and Greg Cantor. Good morning. I'm Linda Martin along with my co-host, uh, Greg Cantor from Murray Lambert Design, Build, Remodel and resident expert on the Approved Home Pro Show. How are you doing this I'm morning? I'm great. How are you, Linda? Good. You have the fancy ear, ear piece there. Well, I got to get one of those. I just don't like my ears covered up. <laughs> <laughs> You're They're well- good looking. Oh, yeah. <laughs> really good looking. Ears. Maybe they should be covered up. If they're too big. <laughs> we have a great show this morning, though. We're talking about curb appeal with system pavers, the driveway and front walk, and why it matters for it to look good. People slow down. Look at your house. Look at the front. Also, when is the best time for your home to get broken into? It may not be what you think. We have Richard from Night Security here, a former cop as well, who will answer that and more security questions. And how to keep your pool sparkling, the top five pool mistakes people have. So is there a good time for your home to be broken into? Yes, there, there is. There Apparently there is. <laughs> there's never a good time for it to be broken into. There's a common time, there's but I'm not sure there's time. a good time. There's a best time for it to be broken into, according to them, to the criminals. Right. So and we, the <laughs> we have a great show ahead. Uh, sit down, relax wherever you are for the next hour. And did you see the TV spots this morning? I glanced up and saw myself. And I thought they were really great on Channel 10 every Saturday morning at 655 and 855. Uh, we do what's called our approved home pro check ins. And earlier today we had we care uh, plumbing, heating, air and solar on there, which was great. But just a few minutes ago, the segment with Reborn Cabinets about their Big Aloha sale they have coming up on Saturday the 19th. Yeah, I saw Vince wearing a, 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 a Hawaiian a shirt and a lay, right? <laughs> well, it's, you know, it's such a great event coming up. They've got huge savings, 20, 30, even more percent off. And it's a huge event with luau food and all kinds of different stuff. We're going to be there the whole show. So make sure you get in, in on your agenda for Saturday the 19th. Reborn Cabinets, if you have any questions, log on to Approved Home Pros. It's going to be a huge event. And it's something everybody should should come out to. So that was a great thing you covered with him. With, is with that him. why you're wearing a grass skirt this morning? Because you're trying to get ready for... No, that's just a Saturday thing. It's I a just, Saturday thing. Okay. Saturday. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, good thing you can't see that, right? Uh, your driveway and front walk, we're going to get into this. Uh, it's a blank canvas for potential curb appeal. It, it's one of the most overlooked but potentially powerful areas to create stunning functional space in your front yard, your driveway. So if you haven't considered the options for upgrading your driveway, you may be missing this huge opportunity to maximize your curb appeal and it's just such an efficient fast it's not an expensive home improvement and it makes so much difference and affects your your living style too you know it does and every time i drive by someone who has this incredible front yard uh, which i don't you know i think i want to look like that i want my house to look like that in the front so with us today from system pavers is steve lawrence and nils youngerson and uh, thanks for being here. Good morning. Thanks for having us. So, Linda, do you know what a pavers is? You know, I, I really don't. I want to have that better explained because, you know, it's, there may be people driving or at home going, what is exactly is a paver? A paver is, you know, it, it's a concrete paving stone. that's come. They're put in molds with different shapes, different textures, different colors. And there's so many different options. That's what really makes a driveway and a front yard so much more exciting with paving stones. I and mean, we'll get into the benefits of them, really, you know, as we, go, as we talk about more about that. But we start talking about the different options compared to just a boring driveway. I mean, it, it's amazing what you can do to your front yard. And so paver is something that's precast, correct? Correct. And it comes in many different, probably thousands of different, different choices. Anything from just simple brick to slate or stone looking materials, right? Yes. Yeah, so there's rustic uh, edges you can put on. There's aged edges. There's different textures on the top. I mean, there are many different sizes. When we started doing this years ago, there was only really a couple sizes. But now with the technology, I mean, we there's a lot of large stones. People are going to a larger stone uh, to make their space even uh, larger um, and, and change the way it looks. And so it's really changed from just the what you thought of a paving stone back in years ago to, I mean, I, I think the technology has changed everything. So why are more and more designer landscape architects and, and homeowners really choosing pavers for their driveways? Well, again, I think there's just so many options. We get down to the strength and the beauty. I mean, the strength of a paver, the paving systems we install, it's about seven to eight times stronger than a, than a concrete driveway But by the time we do that, and it's flexible. Um, but the different options you have with the beauty. I, That's what I would say is the architectural beauty versus trying to use 
poured concrete with color or banding or whatever. It's just nowhere near as nice. Not even close. And Greg, you were talking earlier this morning uh, when we before the show started about how a lot of people want maybe more than just their driveway, and these guys will look at that. Yes, you do full landscape as well, right? Yeah, we'll do a full landscape. We'll change the – for curb appeal, we can change everything about the way the front of your house looks. You know, you, when you drive through neighborhoods and you see a lot of homes with the concrete, and oftentimes you'll see concrete driveways that have, you know, stains in them or, you know, cracks or whatever, and then you see a home that's used pavers, it's just such a dramatic visual difference. Do you, when you guys get into a neighborhood and you do one home, do you find because of that visual impact, that curb appeal, you tend to get more homes in the same neighborhood converting oh, yeah. over? It's contagious. I mean, everybody, <laughs> everybody wants their yard to look – you know, one up the next one. You know, it's it's really is a contagious, infectious. And you brought up a good point, Sean, about that because if if you get oil on cement, you're kind of it's hard to get it out. With pavers, you could replace those pieces, and if you wanted to expand the area, you can easily expand too, right? Yeah, you can you can do anything with these pavers. Uh, you bring up the oil thing. There's a lot of our customers are really concerned with. Oh, I got some oil on it. What do I do? If you can't get the stains out, like you said, we can just pick those stones out, put new ones in. Uh, they're very, very flexible. A lot of things you can do with them. So there's a lot of durability there, then, Absolutely. you're talking about over concrete? Yes. But, you know, before we get into the durability stuff, uh, uh, another thing I want to talk about with the, uh, with the pavers is I think in the past, people have viewed a driveway, and it's almost the same thing. We talked about um, garage doors a couple of weeks ago, Greg, and how pe garage doors used to, used to be a functional piece of metal that just sat there, a piece of wood, and then people realized it could be a piece of the architecture of the curb appeal. Driveways, I think people used to think they were just a functional thing. You needed it so you didn't have to drive on dirt and park your car. Now they're like a canvas that people are using as a major curb appeal element. Is that true? I think it's almost an expectation. In some of these nicer homes you go to, when you're trying to sell a home, when you when you're even speaking of realtors that we deal with, it's almost an expectation. If there's a home that doesn't sell or doesn't stand out, if we put that driveway in or do a little bit of curb appeal with a maybe a front courtyard, or I was just going to say it doesn't end at the driveway. No. You, I'm sure you do sidewalks and porches, you know, patios as part of doing the driveway. Oh, absolutely, mailboxes, backyards, patios. Ah, okay, I'm ready. I'm ready. Mine is one of those functional with the all of that. So yeah, it, it sounds really good. But the the durability thing that we were getting into a little bit, they do hold up. So is that something where you don't have to deal with the splitting and the cracking so much that it's uh it lasts longer? Is that a good way to go? Well, you've got a 16 step process when you're putting the pavers in, and with concrete, you probably have a three or four step process where you're just building them building a mold uh, with the the two by fours, the wood, and then just pouring concrete and smoothing it out. And what happens is. is it, it, at some point, you're going to have cracking, you're going to have breaking, there's going to be lift due to roots or shifting of the earth. With the pavers, you have an interlocking system, and so it's flexible. It's got the firm borders on the sides, and it's bordered by the garage or by the sidewalk. Um, so as far as durability, it's going to last a lot longer. With system pavers, our system, like I said, it's it's pretty extensive system, 16-step process, where you're, you're, you're going in, you're putting a geotextile, you're putting a Class two base and sand and the pavers. What's a Class two base for people that don't understand? Class two base is, is recycled asphalt or concrete, and it's crushed. So it's three-quarter inch down to fines, and then that's compacted. So it's a solid – it's it's almost as, as hard as concrete, except cement hasn't been added in. So that's it. the point is you're putting this class two base down because I'm sure people are concerned because, you know, the pavers go on top. But with that solid base, it's as durable as concrete, right? It's durable. It's flexible. It's going to last long. And then with our warranty, we've got a 25-year warranty, and that's on the installation. It's also on the pavers from breaking or cracking. So if there is an issue down the road where you see slumping or you see ruts, we can come in. You give us a call. We come in, and we're going to take care of the problem. Okay, so if you're at home, we're not done. We, we have some more questions about this, too, because I know people are interested. So if you're at home, you want to make changes, step up that curb appeal. Call System Pavers today. What's stopping you? Call 619-312-6760, and we will be right back with Steve and Niels from System Pavers. Following us on Facebook gets you in on exclusive content, contests, news alerts, and yes, you can even see our faces. Fit for Facebook. Just click on that little blue F. 
at kogo.com. San Diego has hard water that clogs our plumbing and appliances, causing damage, discomfort, and extra expense. Our water looks cloudy, is bad tasting, and can smell foul. The solution is a Hague Quality Water Whole House Filtration System. Hague Quality Water Filtration Systems are customized to your specific water deficiencies and needs. Call Hague Quality Water today at 619-202-5363. Again, that's 619 619- 202-5363. Home Pro Show recommends A1 Rain Gutters for your home. Since 1975, A1 Rain Gutters have provided exceptional appearance and performance. Protect and beautify your home with A1 Rain Gutters by calling 800-A1-GUTTERS or go to a-1raingutters.com. Superior Window Solutions, offering San Diego's best window tinting for home, business, and auto. Reduce heat and glare while you protect your furniture and flooring from harmful UV rays. Call Superior Window Solutions today at 619-500-9465 or visit superiorwindowsolutions.com. There's solar, and then there's smarter solar. At JMAR Power Systems, they make solar smarter. And at JMAR Power Systems, they bring substantial savings to your energy bills. This means more money in your pocket. And you can get your new system installed with zero down and low monthly payments. Hey, that means more money in your pocket. Hey, guess what? The sooner you talk to JMAR Power Systems, the sooner you'll start saving money. Visit freesolarquote.com or call them at 619-333-8662. Best Value Glass is a full-service glass shop with over 25 years of experience. Specializing in Milgard windows, they offer dual-pane, low-E vinyl, fiberglass, and aluminum windows. Best Value Glass designs and supplies custom shower enclosures and mirrored wardrobe doors. They fabricate and install custom mirrors and glass for residential and commercial purposes. Visit Best Value Glass at their showroom in El Cajon or at bvglass.com and request a quote. Best Value Glass is a certified Milgard dealer. Contractor's license 8285. Two six. News Radio 600 Kogo, San Diego's home for news, weather, traffic. You're listening to the Approved Home Pro Show, your friends in the home improvement business. And welcome back. It's Linda Martin here along with uh, Greg Cantor and our guest from System Pavers. We're talking about curb appeal, changing your driveway and more in the front walk. So you smile every time you drive up. <laughs> and we have our guest, Steve Lawrence and Nils Youngerson. Did I say that right? That is that is a, a great name. No, that was perfect. <laughs> <laughs> You're the first person. <laughs> uh, for, they're from System Pavers. They're talking about all these questions about really when you drive up, the, front, the way the front of your house looks makes a huge difference, Greg. Yes, it does. Um, I mean, the curb appeal is so important, and the, this, these pavers – accomplish some great things right guys yeah absolutely so we have this offer that we want to talk about from system pavers you get this uh, free demolition and removal of your old concrete or asphalt which is fantastic and they give you instant cash credit toward your beautiful outdoor living makeover and this is an offer that's not going to last uh, forever but you have some time yeah this is the best time of the year to buy the driveways or any any paving project for that matter. I heard Qualcomm needs their asphalt replaced. Would you do that? <laughs> well, we did Angel Stadium years ago, so we, we might be in the market for that. So you've done some really big projects then. Yeah, we have. To, to take advantage of that offer, what's the right number to call? Uh, you want to give a call to 619-312-6760. Or approvedhomepros.com slash system pavers, so people will know that. And so getting into these questions, you know, we were talking about uh, your driveway. You know, I had a question actually for Greg, and maybe you guys can talk about it. We, with the with concrete, if you have a concrete driveway and you have, because I've seen this a million times, where somebody had a pipe that was running in under it or something, there's a jackhammer and a saw involved to cut that concrete. Right. Is, is, are pavers the same? Well, with pavers, you could re- remove a strip, and re- if you're, let's say, your sewer line goes out, which happens a lot in San Diego, and you need to trench from your property line to tie in a new line, you can take the pavers out, trench it, and then put your Class two base back down right and yep. replace those pavers. Yep, relay those pavers. We have it happen a lot with utilities uh, roots. There's a lot of root problems in California. Those trees are looking for water everywhere, so they start lifting concrete. If it was a paving system, you eliminate the root and go right back into relaying your pavers. Well, and sometimes people like want me to do a room addition, and we have to run a sewer line to the new addition with pavers. It's you know we're home free. So what? What in terms of dollars? What could that save somebody? 
thousands, thousands easily. Of dollars. Yeah. yeah well, wow. it's not just the money; it's the look too. Oh, yeah. If and you were hassle, concrete, yeah. you'll, never, you'll never match the concrete. You'll never match that. It's going to be saw cut and try to patch it. It's just going to. It's not going to look the same. Well, so let's talk a, a little bit of beyond the driveways. Then, uh, what else can system pavers do then? Anything that you want to do to enjoy your outdoors. I mean, we really bring. We have outdoor barbecues. We have fireplaces, fire pits. Uh, we do front courtyards. We do walls. Uh, lighting. Lighting is one of my favorite things that we do because with we do all the beautiful hardscaping and then you light that up it's one of the least the least expensive things that we do on a project but it's probably the biggest bang for your buck that you well, can really and the do. point i would make too that's great about system pavers is your design build so you you do the uh, landscape design as well as the installation right that's correct beginning to end and that's great and you make some suggestions sometimes if somebody says oh, i just want to do my driveway you'll look at the big picture we listen yeah but uh we, we usually know which direction we should be going with it. We we try and guide, but we listen for sure. Well, certainly. I mean, for me, being a homeowner, I would like to, to hear the feedback to, you know, say, hey, you know, you could do this if you want to. Yeah. And you don't have to do it all at one time. Some people do it in phases, right? You might just have the money to do the driveway right now, but if you have in mind, I want to do the walkway, the courtyard, the lighting, it can be done in more than one phase. I would say the majority of our customers are usually going into a phase. We, we build up the entire dream, and then usually we're doing phase one or phase two, you know, to, to start the project. Okay, well, that sounds terrific. So uh, you get a lot of great feedback. I know we talked about that, too, this morning from uh, people who've had this done. What do they say? Well, people are extremely happy with the finished product. A lot of times you've got people who have been waiting a couple of years to do it. Um, it's transformed the front of their homes. It's improved their property values. They start to spend more time outside. They're enjoying the outdoors. The whole thing about Southern California, San Diego especially, is the indoor-outdoor living space. And it's transformed it. It's changed their lives. I've had customers that weren't able to use their backyard. Now they're having friends and family over. They're spending more time out there with their kids. And it's just made a, a, a significant improvement. When you talk about the front yard and the curb appeal, the other thing it starts to do is it starts to get people interested in improving the other properties on the street. So now you've raised the value of your home. Other neighbors are improving their properties, and that's a win-win for everybody. All right. Hey, thank you so much uh, for, for talking about this because uh, – I, I hope people can get on the phone today and call you. The number, again, to get in touch, see what you can do for your own front yard, uh, 619-312-6760 or approvedhomepros.com slash system pavers. And if they do that, the offer, I think, is an incredible offer. Get it is an incredible. Time. I mean, that's a big savings to have that existing concrete removed and hauled away. And then get, they give a cash credit for that, too, right? Definitely. Uh, that's huge. Um, and you can also go to approvedhomepros.com forward slash uh, system papers, I believe it's forward slash system papers. Uh, find out more about that. All right, guys. Hey, thank you so much uh, for being here, Steve and Nils. Appreciate oh, well, thank your you time. Very much. Yeah, that was great. All right, so uh, all about the the way it looks when you drive up. It just it does make you smile. And remember, the experts at Approved Home Pros are the very best. Provided to you free at approvedhomepros.com or calling. It's, what is it, 855-840-APRO-2776. Wow. Hey, I'm getting. I love I'm getting that you say the numbers because that screws me up when I can't. When I, I know you're there trying to think of it. I'm thinking that's going to take me forever. Come on, two seven seven six. That's what it is. All right, thanks, guys. Now it's time to talk about security or lack of it from an expert, a former law enforcement officer, now a security expert. He's answering questions like, uh, when is the optimal time for a burglar to break in? Of course, we hope it never happens. <laughs> exactly. But, but sometimes it does, right? So Richard Mace is president of Night Security, one of only a handful of locally owned and locally monitored home security companies. And he's a former police officer. Thank you for being in here. Well, thanks for inviting me. Yes. And, you know, uh, Greg, you pointed this out this morning, too. It's so nice to to not think of a, a large company when you're thinking about security. You think of something that's that's local and it's uh, a family owned. And I love that about night. Yes, they're a family owned business. They're local. They're they're. I mean, they're few and far between how many local alarm and security companies there are. And having your own monitoring and doing your own installations I mean, that's huge. Yeah. Well, it helps. And we actually are multi-generational. My, both my sons are involved in the business. And so we will continue under the name and the same ownership for hopefully for a lot of years. How many years has it been? I've been with the company almost 40 and we're about a 55 year old company. Wow. So my goodness. What is it you do then? Let's talk okay. about the over here for night security. Okay. Well, the first thing we do is, of course, educate people. And you hit the major point. What is your burglary problem? which is basically 9 o'clock in the morning to about 3.30 in the afternoon when homes are vacant. This is when homes are normally, unfortunately, broken into. It's not in the middle of the night. So 
Um, we basically meet with a homeowner, answer their questions, which everyone has a, a number of questions, and show them that alarms can be affordable, flexible to their lifestyle, and end their problem of peace of mind. They don't have to worry when they go to work on vacation that they're going to get broken into. Well, an impor important thing is I'm sure you see all the time you go into homes where people have had security systems that aren't, aren't being used. Uh, constantly. I'm, people actually apologize. They hate to tell me, and I know what they're going to say, that I'm not using my alarm, and I know why. Because it didn't meet their needs or their lifestyle. It's cumbersome or confusing, and we've got to simplify it. You know, uh, again, this morning we're answering some of the most common questions about home security, like, you know, when the the time of day, it's during the day that, that a lot of burglars do this. And what about when the power goes out? Okay. Simple questions on power. Almost all alarm systems have battery backup. So when your power goes out and your alarm clock is flashing 3 o'clock in the morning when you wake up, uh, your alarm system will be fine. It'll be on battery all night. When it power comes back on, it switches back automatically. It's not even a factor. Well, and the other thing, too, is now that most people have phones through their coax, through their cable provider, so if the phone, their phones go out, that used to be an issue. But with you, don't you have wireless connectivity? Exactly. Um, analog phone lines are really going away at an incredible pace. People are going strictly cellular, and alarms now communicate by cellular faster and safer. So nope. if the power goes out and your phones go out, you're still covered, it's right? Completely operational. That's that's really good to know because I was wondering about the cell phone. So many people don't have landlines yeah. anymore, so that's a good right. good part of it. Now, another thing, it's really hot. It gets even hotter in September and October. Uh, can you have your windows open and still have security? Absolutely. People ask this question all the time. You can have windows that you keep vented at night for to your room's cool, completely set up so your alarm can be on and while you sleep and yet good airflow. So do you recommend the venting system for that or or the security screens because i know people go back and forth about b buying the security screens that can be kind of difficult at times you know i go both ways depending on their needs the ultimate best solution is no question is security screen it ends any uh, preparation the venting is almost a free option right so a lot of people choose it so with a screen if somebody cuts it anywhere that sets the alarm the al off, right? it does exactly but yet if the cat climbs it from the inside it doesn't set the alarm so <laughs> it's very flexible speaking of the cat and the dog i used to have one of those uh, archaic systems when i was a kid in houston in our house and every time the dog or cat would run around it would go off and we'd all come out with baseball bats and think okay <laughs> who's in the house right right so what about if you have a dog or a cat? Well, nowadays, fortunately, electronics has imp have improved to be able to handle uh, small animals in the home. It, there was a day, because I've been in the industry a long time, when it was a nuisance, and it really has gone away. You know, one of the, th uh, the things, we, we don't just promote companies like Night Security. We use them. And, and Jordan uh, Frazier, who you guys probably all know from our TV show, our infield reporter, she is a Night Security customer. Correct. And her dog, Sammy, who comes in the office all the time, um, she was concerned about that when you first put the system in the house, but you guys looked at him, his habits, and you would, uh, created a security system that worked with Sam, her dog. Exactly right. I mean, I personally sat in her bedroom and saw how the dog moved until we designed it so that it would work for the dog, let the dog move around, not set off the alarm. And so she's completely comfortable now with the dog. If you have a doggy door, can that work too with the security it, system? Certainly. It can be adjusted for it. My goodness. Okay, so there's so much that have to has to do with this, but they really have come a long way, the security systems, from the way that they uh, used to. No question about it. And they've and expanded their uh, coverage. Fire is one of the big things that we stress with people. Everybody always starts with burglary, but fire is your biggest danger, and that's now available. And, the, and you have uh, fire alarms that are wired into the systems, right? Exactly right. Separate than their normal. Yep. Oh. All right. So, you know, we, we have an offer here, too. It, it, well, or just to let people know how they can uh, get in touch with you. If you're interested in looking into a security system and you can't be too careful. Um, I live in Coronado. I see these break-ins all the time. And they're usually at smaller houses, too. It's not the, the big giant ones that you see sometimes. I think they, they look at the, the front door and think, okay, daytime. I've seen it happen. There are more and more break-ins in the middle of the day. Call Night Security. It's local. It's family-owned. It's honest. 619-797-6603 or go to approvedhomepros.com slash night and that's night like night in shining armor and they do have an offer they 10 percent up, up off up to 500 you honor this 
absolutely. It's been offered. Sure. All right. We'll be back with some more questions about security, too, when we come back on the Approved Home Pro Show. This is a Fox News Alert. I'm Jane Metzler. Virginia's Governor Terry McAuliffe declares a state of emergency after violence erupts at a Unite the Right rally in Charlottesville. White nationalists protesting plans to remove a statue of Confederate General Robert E. Lee. Counter demonstrators chanting, Nazis go home. <laughs> Riot police are at the scene, so is Fox's Doug McElway. You can see people who are taking treatment here for having been maced. Let's go ask this guy what happened to him real quick. Sir, can I talk to you? Tell me what happened. What happened I can't you? talk right we're now, on, bro. We're on live TV. Oh, I got hit with um, pepper spray. Uh -huh. Who did it? One of the Nazis. Several arrests made. House Speaker Paul Ryan tweeting that the views expressed are repugnant and vile bigotry. This is a Fox News alert. From the San Diego County Credit Union Traffic Center, an earlier wreck has now cleared West 78 toward the San Marcos Boulevard exit. Now we do have slow speeds right now as you travel down the coastline from the Poinsettia exit on down to Lucadia Boulevard where some work zones going on, some construction. Uh, they do have the right lanes closed off because of that through Encinitas on down to Lucadia. Everywhere else looking good. This report brought to you by True Car. With True Car, you can see what others paid for the car you want so you can recognize a great deal. True Car users on average save over $3,000 off MSRP. For newer used cars, visit True Car for a more confident car buying experience. I'm Marcy Latimer. Kogo's next real time traffic update, 10 o'clock. You know Millholland as San Diego's most trusted name in solar and electric. Well, now you can turn to the Millholland team for your roofing needs with the same confidence they have earned over the past 25 years of service to San Diego. The Millholland name stands for quality, service, and strict attention to detail. Don't trust your roof to any less than the best. Call Millholland Solar Electric and Roofing today, 619-320-7373. Or go to millhollandsolar.com. That's M-I-L hollandsolar.com. When you need a plumber, you need a company you can rely on. You need a company that is focused on helping you, solving your problems, and saving you money. In San Diego, the clear choice is Black Mountain Plumbing. At Black Mountain Plumbing, they have a commitment to excellence, quality, and integrity in everything they do. Serving our community since 1993, Black Mountain Plumbing can help you with plumbing repairs, drain cleaning, leak detection, water heaters, water filtration systems, and more. Call Black Mountain Plumbing today at 619-399-22. Since 1984, Simi Trim has been San Diego's one-stop shop for entry doors, interior doors, and all finish work, including crown molding, baseboards, and more. If you want an entry to impress, call Simi Trim for your free estimate at 619-500-9480. Nothing makes a kitchen look more spectacular than brand new cabinetry. If you want to transform the look of your home, the Approved Home Pro Team recommends Reborn Cabinets. Since 1983, Reborn Cabinets has provided the finest in custom cabinets, cabinet refacing, remodeling, and even bathroom solutions. Nothing makes a bigger impact than a new kitchen, and no one does it like Reborn Cabinets. So call today for your free consultation at 619-431-0073. That's 619-431-0073. In San Diego, you should be getting a termite inspection at least once per year. Approved Home Pro users get your annual inspection totally free, courtesy of Best Rate Termite. Call Best Rate today to schedule your free termite inspection at 619 407 9097. Best quality, best service, best rate. iHeartRadio wants nothing more than to bring you closer to your favorite artists. This is Mick Jagger of the Rolling Stones. So we've updated the iHeartRadio app. No, it's an upgrade. All your favorite music and stations, easier to find. Getting you closer to the music you love with just a tap. Hey, this is Brett Michaels, and this is iHeartRadio. All your favorite music, all your favorite stations, all free. Download and open the new iHeartRadio app today. <laughs> iHeartRadio is the easy-to-use app for music and radio. Download the free iHeartRadio app today. Welcome back to the Approved Home Pro Show, San Diego's most trusted home improvement resource. To the Welcome back to the Approved Home Pro Show on Kogo Radio. Hey, Linda, I love Thompson Building Materials and their amazing indoor-outdoor showroom. 
They're located right off the 94 freeway near College Avenue. When are we going? When do we check it out? We're going to go on a road trip. When do you check it out again? When do I check it out? Very soon. I've been talking about this great place to source materials of all types of for home remodeling and custom homes for a very long time. Today, I wanted to talk about client experiences. Dan T. said, great business to work with, great customer service. They went out of their way to ensure my materials were delivered on time. As a resident expert, I recommend you check out their showroom or go, or go to thompsonbldg.com slash San Diego. That's thompsonbldg.com San Diego or call 619-287-9410. All right. I'm ready. We're going to go soon this week. So we're talking about we right before the break. What was the optimal time to get burglarized? Uh, and apparently it's right in the middle of the day, which is, uh, you know, it's hard to believe because you do see everything in the movies skulking around at night, that kind of thing. And so we're <laughs> talking to uh, Richard Mates with Night Security, a former police officer on the Approved Home Pro Show. And, uh, and one of the things that we were about to talk about, and you had a great question, uh, Gray, was about uh, signing a long term contract. Yes. And I know these national companies that are all over the place and sometimes their franchises even they advertise these kind of lost leader $99 specials and they put in the equipment but then they lock you into a two-year contract right Richard that's exactly correct you know all alarm companies have secure have contract they're an agreement between a homeowner and a company so everybody knows what they're responsible for and what they get we have certainly have agreements well, we've had a policy of 30-day contracts. We've had that for 30 years. You're with us because you want to be. And all the warranties and protection for the homeowner are spelled out in clear language and that, so people are comfortable. And I bet you have a huge, like, high retention rate, right? It's incredible. I mean, people stay with us because they get direct, they get service from a local company. They can reach the man they spoke to originally, and people feel very comfortable with that. You know, going back, people have heard my story, mine and Heather's, why we started this. We got taken to taken advantage of by unscrupulous contractors. One of the other experiences that I had that was really disturbing to me, Greg, was we signed up with one of these national security companies. It's a three-letter company that everybody sees advertised all over the place. There's really only two companies on most of the alarm companies out there. There's the three-letter one and the one named after a big body of water, a bay, right? right? The, the one you're talking about is the first letter in the alphabet, right? A something T <laughs> something. Yeah, A something T. Um, and uh, we had to – it was in Phoenix, and we had to move – and I didn't realize the contract that I had signed was this because they got me so, soaked, sucked in with this 995 kind of thing. And I had actually, I should have read it in more detail, committed us to hundreds and hundreds of dollars. I told them I needed to move. I had to pay hundreds of dollars to get out of the contract. And it was a horrible experience. Do, do you see a lot of people get fooled with that kind of stuff, Greg? Do you think it's something that happens a lot out there? Well, I just think people get fooled by those cheap systems and then and they get sold up a lot of times too. I mean... I'm not sure how often those cheap systems even get installed. And then people are tempted to go to the big box stores and do it yourself, which is, I think, just a waste of money. Well, it can be. I mean, as I always tell people, look at the big box store. They didn't put their system for their protection. They got it professionally done. Right. And uh, Richard, you know, just um, talking when we were talking in the break here, you were saying when your alarm goes off, where does it go? Who did the police, the fire department? Is it the same way it's always been? Great, or different? great question. Alarm systems do not go directly to the police or fire. This is why there's a, a small monthly charge associated with alarms, because a signal goes to a monitoring facility operated by your alarm company to dispatch police, fire, or paramedics based on your needs and requirements. And so it goes to your cell phone number, right? Absolutely not. <laughs> no. no. I have to Richard sleep with that. But, but to answer that, but the question is, are we there 24 hours a day? Yes. Absolutely. You can call us at 2 in the morning and you don't have to apologize. We're up. We're there to answer your question and help you. And what happens is when an alarm goes off, and I, it's happened at our house, they call you to make sure you're okay, first of all, right. and to make sure it's a real alarm no or not just a false alarm right and help you disarm it if you need that and prevent the police from being accidentally dispatched which is a big issue in today's world there's just one other thing i know we're kind of running out of time with with richard but i want to make one last point with you and then and then kind of give a, a huge endorsement to, to this company but a lot of people feel like they're safe because the, the husband may say we don't need an alarm system i have a gun right is, is that True or not? It's absolutely not true. Unfortunately, the gentleman's thinking in the evening when he's asleep, and the burglary's happening during the day, and unfortunately, one of the most commonly stolen things is his gun. 
because <laughs> they're you know, looking for that's it. what they want. That's, that's the high, what they, they want. They can find that on the streets for, for exactly anymore. You want an alarm system to give you early warning, protect the family, and provide peace of mind for your family. Yeah, I, I personally am such a believer in night security. I, I, Greg, I know you are too. Jordan uses well, them. And Linda, I have we're going to get you on the system. We have a system that we're not using, and I'm. I want Richard to call me and get out there. So we're going to fix that. Yes. And you know what I really like though is just to, to quick out on. I know we're running out of time, but uh, what's the track record for break-ins on homes that do have a security system? This is one of the most uh, rewarding parts of our industry: is folks that have security take it seriously, arm it when they leave the house, arm it at night, have an absolute incredible track record of not having successful bur burglaries. Okay, well, that is terrific. Uh, so the offer again, 10% uh, off up to $500. Exactly. So let's get protected. There's no reason not to. Yeah. And especially with the, remember, local, family-owned, uh, Richard Mates it, with Night Security. The number again is 619-797-6603 or go to approvedhomepros.com slash night as in night in shining armor. And Richard, when they call you, you'll answer any of their questions. You'll walk them through Absolutely. everything. And it's, 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 at least find out about this because it's protecting you, your family, your home. So call Richard and let right. him answer your questions. As, as much as somebody just having a simple question and I'll answer it over the phone for them. All right. Hey, thanks so much for being here. Thank you. Got to watch out during the day. <laughs> Thank you. If you're just tuning in, uh, we're talking about home improvement with the experts. Before you do any home improvement, I know it can feel daunting. You're going to be spending a lot of money to take on projects. Uh, so you want it to be good. Go to ApprovedHomePros.com and see who we've approved. And we're, next, we're talking about pools and the top five pool mistakes homeowners can make. I think that I make all of these mistakes, actually, because we were talking about this before. I have a pool, and it's just... It's killing me. Well, <laughs> I gotta... We'll make it real easy. <laughs> Before you get into the five top things, I think one mistake is trying to do it yourself. <laughs> <laughs> right? That probably is. Javier Payan is here, the owner of a Payan Pool Service, which uh, covers the county. So want people to know that. When... Right, good morning, Linda. Good morning. Right, hey, Javier. So, you know, we've got uh, the long Labor Day weekend coming, last stragglers of in-laws and relatives and friends coming in this weekend. We want it to look sparkling and good and not make mistakes. So, uh, you know, hey, thanks for being here. This is uh, one of the only, uh, one of the few licensed professional pool service companies. So you're a real pro. Yeah, you know you. your stuff. <laughs> I appreciate that. Thank you. Uh, so you cover the Cole, ha Cole County and you look at the problems. So let's go from five to one. Let's say the top sure. five. We'll do it uh, sort of like David Letterman, but but not. Hold on. I get the drum roll going? <laughs> yeah, the drum roll. <laughs> so I asked our technicians what they're seeing in the field and uh, simple common mistakes that can be avoided. And we narrowed it down to uh, the we narrowed the long list down to five. And so um, uh, our technicians. Um, had the ideas, they brought it to us, and uh, and we put it on our blog and it's on our Facebook and as well as at Home Pro Show. But anyhow, so um, number one, uh, number five rather is not maintain your pool equipment. So two components in particular, uh, one is the pool heater, which they're several thousand dollars to replace. And uh, um, while most people don't always use their their pool heaters because they're not heating their pools, the water's always going through there. And so there's internal components that need to be, you know, um, checked to make sure the heater is going to run efficiently when it turns on. But also, too, you get critters in there. You get rodents that like to build nests inside. And they love chewing on wires. And when uh, wires short circuit, they short circuit circuit boards, which could be pretty costly. And mm -hmm. also, too, spiders like to get in and uh, build webbing inside no gas nozzles. So and when, that can be a huge issue, right? Yeah, that sometimes awful. in a worst case scenario, what will happen is the, the gas will not... Um, if a nozzle is clogged from a spider web, the gas will actually not ignite with the um, igniter. It'll bellow inside the, the heater chamber, and then when it does finally ignite, it goes off with a big boom, and uh, a one-time boom, but it freaks everybody out. I've had that at my house, too, that big boom. Yeah. I thought the pool heater was exploding or something. It's, it's, it's that's actually what was happening. <laughs> Little spiders. <laughs> Little Great. spiders. Great. That's such a, a comforting thought. And then, so uh, I, I know, uh, Greg, you were talking about this, the unrealistic expectations for saltwater chlorine generators. Yes, and... Javier does my pool, not personally, but his guys do, and they're great. And what I what I really like is, I mean, this is the first saltwater pool I've ever had, and, and and you just need to know that it requires annual maintenance. And what's great about Pion is you have it plugged into your system. I get an email when it's time to clean out that salt capsule. 
Yeah. The also, uh, also, too, on, uh, on the mistakes, um, on number four here is unreal, unrealistic expectations of a saltwater chlorine generator. Now, saltwater chlorine generator, its job is to produce chlorine, and it's a cleaner type of chlorine, so it, it increases, uh, it makes an enhanced bathing experience. Now, um, it doesn't do everything, and it has the ability to produce a one pound of chlorine per 24 hour period, and uh, that's equivalent to about one gallon. Now, if people don't run them long enough and they have high bather load, then we have to supplement it with chlorine. So the uh, mistake people make is they don't run them long enough to produce the, the chlorine that they need. But you need a professional to establish how long they need to run, correct? Yeah, and it's a constant adjustment as well, too. Okay. Uh, okay. I, I have one quick question. Um, Oh, we running out of time? When we come back, yeah, hold that thought, uh, Sean, because uh, we're going to get more into the, the mistakes people make with their pools, especially because you know, summer's not over yet. We still want to dive in or ju- do a belly flop, maybe, in my case. <laughs> um, so anyway, we're talking with Javier. When we come back, we have more pool questions. Remember, the number is 619-202-1153 or go to approvedhomepros.com slash P-A-Y-A-N. P-A-Y-A-N. Let's stop the car and gas tax increase. Don't for a moment think that these people give a rip about your pothole. The campaign to abolish the California car and gas tax hike. Listen for an update at 445 weekdays during the DeMaio Report on COGO. Hi, I'm Matt Mozzie, president of Mozzie Heating and Air. You and your family deserve comfort. Nothing can disturb that comfort more than it being too hot or too cold. Let me and my team at Mozzie Heating and Air help you with any heating or cooling need. For over 40 years, Mozzie has been providing homeowners like you fast service and comfort for a family budget. We always provide you upfront pricing, so there are never surprises. Mozzie, your trusted partner. Reach us at 855-840-APRO or go to mozzieair.com. That's M-A-U-Z-Y-A-I-R.com. License number 759171. This is Sue Freeze, the termite lady. At Ecola, we get it. You want your termite problems solved with a minimum hassle to your lifestyle. With our full range of alternative and traditional termite treatments, our expert technicians can develop a solution that will meet your specific needs. We have been serving homeowners for over 30 years. Ecola, powerful termite and pest control, as gentle as a butterfly and mother approved. For a free estimate, call 800 332 BUGS. That's 800 332 BUGS. Or go to termitelady.com. Com. Everything you own, everything you cherish is under your roof. Smart San Diego homeowners protect their roof and their home by calling Top Line Roofing for a no-cost roofing evaluation. Since 1991, Top Line Roofing has been providing honest, professional roofing services to the San Diego community. Top Line Roofing takes pride in their training and certifications from the nation's best roofing manufacturers and industry associations. Call Top Line Roofing today to schedule your roof evaluation at 858-905-5903 or visit ApprovedHomePros.com slash top line. The Approved Home Pro Show is proud to be presented in part by Cross Country Mortgage Incorporated. Cross Country Mortgage has helped members of the Approved Home Pro team with our own mortgage needs and the experience has been stellar, so we recommend them with confidence. The local Cross Country Mortgage team can give you the advantage you need in a competitive housing market with their fast track credit approval. They've been helping clients just like you get the right home financing solutions for their unique needs. So Cross Country Mortgage knows what it takes to make your home ownership dream come to life. Cross Country Mortgage, the only mortgage company recommended by approved home pros. Call Cross Country Mortgage today at 619-210-0157 or go to approvedhomepros.com slash cross country. All loans subject to underwriting approval. Certain restrictions apply. Call for details. Equal housing opportunity. Cross Country Mortgage, Inc. NMLS 3029. NMLSconsumeraccess.org. Licensed by the Department of Business Oversight under the California Residential Mortgage Lending Act. Branch address 3655 Nobel Drive, Suite 300, San Diego, California 92122. Branch NMLS 146. Are you tired of your worn or peeling epoxy floor? Have you dreamed of a beautiful garage with a durable, long-lasting floor coating? Approved Home Pros recommends Perkins Custom Coatings, San Diego's largest floor coating installer for all your residential and commercial floor coating needs. Perkins features SpartaFlex, which delivers a superior finish without the damage from hot tires associated with epoxy-based coatings. There is a difference, and the difference is Perkins Custom Coatings. Call for your free estimate at 619-333-8783 or go to Approved Home Pro slash Perkins. This is Greg Cantor. At Murray Lampert Design Build Remodel, we're different. 
As one of the oldest local home improvement firms in San Diego, it's very important to me to hear what our clients have to say. My philosophy is there's always room for improvement. That's why I visit our completed projects to listen. Reputation matters, and we've been building ours for over 40 years. So to schedule an in-home consultation with the Design Pro, visit murraylampert.com. Murray Lampert Design Build Remodel. Improving San Diego homes since 1975. License number 458038. I'm always asked how Window World can offer so much value at our low prices, and it's simple. We're America's largest window replacement company, and since we sell more windows than anyone else, we sell them for less. Call 1-800-NEXT-WINDOW for your free in-home estimate. Here at Window World, we're into conserving. Conserving energy and saving money. Right now, get five premium windows and a patio slider for only $38.19 installed. Visit windowworldsandiego.com for a free in-home estimate. San Diego weather, plenty of sunshine expected throughout the weekend. Highs in the 70s along the beaches, 80s inland. This report brought to you by True Car. With True Car, you can see what others paid for the car you want so you can recognize a great deal. True Car users on average save over $3,000 off MSRP. For new or used cars, visit True Car for a more confident car buying experience. News Radio 600, Kogo. If you're looking for approved home pros, you're in the right place. This is the Approved Home Pro Show. This time of year, it's so important for people to have a good company that if your air conditioning goes down or you have some problem with it, you need to be able to have somebody you're going to be able to call. Absolutely. And we still have this heat wave going on. So people are running their air and you want to have efficient air conditioning. But pretty soon uh, we're, we're going to turn the corner and it's going to start to get cold again. So it's a good time to also have your furnace checked out. Make sure your filters are clean and just maybe get a tune up. Yeah, absolutely. They're, they're, they're a great company for just about anything you want to be able to do for your home, for your, um, uh, for your heating, cooling, any of those needs. I love the team at We Care Plumbing, Heating, Air, and Solar. Uh, you can call them anytime, 619-333-8646, 619-333-8646. And just a little tip, we had talked to them earlier today on TV about some of the rebates that are available to help get a new air conditioning system. When you, when you call them, Ask about that because you'd be surprised at what kind of rebates are out there available from actually SDG&E to help you get a new air conditioning system. All right, Sean and Greg, uh, Linda here. We're talking about uh, pools. We were before the break. Keeping them sparkling clean, the top uh, five mistakes that, that uh, people make with their pools. And I, and I pretty much make all of them, I think. You guys are more <laughs> savvy than I am. But I'm learning. I'm learning. And we're here with Javier Payan from Payan Pool Service. And he is uh, giving us the countdown here on that. And, Sean, you had a question before that uh, you teased us with. Yeah, you guys were talking about the salt water systems, and, and I think the, the, one of the mistakes was people overestimating what they're capable of doing. But I think people also get confused. The salt water system, I think people think they don't use chlorine in those, but actually it converts the salt to chlorine in some way, right? Exactly. So there's still a chlorine system. It's exactly what it does. Yeah, so it, it converts sodium chloride, which is salt, to sodium hypochlorite, which is chlorine. So you are making chlorine. It's just, it's just a cleaner version of chlorine. And it's a very small amount of salt, right? Yeah, it's uh, typically about 3,000 parts per, per million, which is nothing um, like the ocean, I think it's like 15,000 parts per so million. You, so you think about going into a salt pool and it's going to be like the ocean, but yeah. it really isn't. It's, it should be similar to the salt in your tears. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so it's a, quite a difference there. So number four, we're, we're doing the countdown up from five to one. Uh, improper water levels? Yes, we see this all the time. So. The proper water level is right at the middle of the skimmer box, which is typically right at the middle of the tile line. So a pool's got a six-inch tile trim that goes around the pool, and uh, right in the middle is where you want it for the skimmer to pull the water. When the water level drops, the skimmer starts pulling air, and that air goes into the plumbing, and um, it goes through the equipment. And you got to keep in mind that the water is what helps to keep all the equipment cool. And so when Mine it makes a terrible sound, yeah, when it gets it, below, it, it reminds me because it sounds awful. It can gurgle. That's a good reminder there. Um, anyhow, so what will happen, though, is the, uh, the equipment is designed to have water running through it. When, when you get air, the whatever water's in the pipes turns to steam and it gets really hot. And, and most pools have PVC plumbing, which is rated at 140 um, degrees. And that water can quickly get up to two, 300 degrees and melt all the plumbing, which is a costly repair. Okay, that's not good. When it gets that far, it's not good. Okay, and then inadequate pump filter runtimes. That's number three? Yeah, so uh, that number two, inadequate runtime. So 
Um, we were talking at the break that, um, Linda, you said you're getting a big electric bill and you have a pool. And, it's huge. And it was more than $700 last month. Ouch. Well, when um, when people get those bills, the first thing they want to do is shorten the run times of the pool. And if it doesn't run long enough, you can't keep the water clear. Well, and Linda has two problems. I think she doesn't have a variable <laughs> I have more speed. more than two. <laughs> <laughs> she doesn't have a variable speed pool pump, and it's probably not set properly. Yeah, and uh, it's probably running too long as well too to keep the wa- the the pool clean and sparkling right now. And when it's you know ninety degrees, well, actually it doesn't get ninety degrees in Coronado, does it? No, it doesn't. It's nice it and cool all the time. September and October. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Yeah, so um, these are all really good uh, things to know. And it's funny because I've had pool people that come in and they all kind of, uh, they diss one another. They'll come in and go, oh, well, they didn't change your filters and they didn't do this. That doesn't happen at Bayan. No, we uh, we try to be professionals all the time. So is it time for my uh, It's number one. My get, test question get, here? Get to number one. Okay, so number but, one is. But p- people putting chlorine tablets in skimmers. In skimmers. In skimmers. Okay, so what's my test question? Oh, what um, <laughs> what's what is the uh, the chlorine tablet made out of? Uh, I believe it's trichloroes tri triazine triod trion. Oh, that's right! Wow! Wow! Yeah. Off the top of your head, <laughs> that's right. just how do you spell that? You want me just to spell kidding, it? Really? I'm kidding. <laughs> we'll say it three times fast, right? We'll we'll give them a gold star. <laughs> <laughs> so these uh, chlorine tablets, they're very acidic. And uh, um, they're highly chlorinated with concentrate, uh, concentrated with chlorine. So um, it's really easy to put a tablet in a skimmer, and as the the water's flowing through the system, it erodes the tablet, and all that chlorine gets into the system, which really is an effective way to get chlorine in the water. However, when the pump shuts off, that chlorine tablet, keep in mind, is highly acidic, about 2.0. Um, it just sits the there, scale. right? It just sits there and continues to dissolve. And every morning. When that pump turns on, that acidic solution goes right through your pump, your filter, your heater, causing more damage. And particularly with the heaters, again, that's one of the most um, uh, expensive pieces of equipment. It actually erodes the copper inside, causing leaks, and that's a really costly repair. In most cases, you're better off just replacing the heater than doing a repair on it. I was just going to say, it sounds like a massive amount of damage. It is, and we do a warranty for all the brands of equipment we put in, and oftentimes we go out on a warranty, and the warranty gets denied because people are putting tablets and skimmers. So that's a good top five list. And I know that you're going to have, I have a couple of uh, follow-up questions, but uh, you'll have this top five, or you do now, on yeah, your we, Facebook page? We've posted on our company Facebook page. Our, our website is pionpools.com, and we have a, um, a Facebook page linked to that. And then I believe Sean's going to post it on the Home Pro site. Yeah, we just did. Well, at approvedhomepros.com, um, it's going to be in the um, uh, uh, show extra section on Monday morning, but we just put it on our Facebook page, at Approved Home Pros. So it's right there. We just did a Facebook uh, post with it. Yes. All right. So any uh, tips then going into this Labor Day weekend? Because, uh, again, for it, this is the last of the summer. Everyone's excited to jump in the pool and have the barbecues. Sure. Maintain those pools. But most importantly, when people are out enjoying their pools, remember to keep an eye on the kids. Pool safety is a big, big um, issue. And oftentimes people neglect um, watching the kids because they think everyone can swim. And that's and when accidents happen. I think everybody should assign one person at all times to watch the pool. Definitely. Yeah, you know, when I've seen kids in our pool, too, and it's quiet. It's not you got to be super careful. Quick. Uh, so you're offered 10% off t- up to $500 when you mention approved home pros. That's correct. Okay. And the number is 619-202-1153 or go to approvedhomepros.com slash Payan. And Thank anybody you. out there, if you have a pool and you haven't had Javier and his team come out and give you an estimate, Greg, they do your pool. They do for a long time and they've been great. I mean, they knock on the door when they come so that we can put our dogs away and it's awesome. If, if you haven't had them come out and at least give you an estimate, they're by far the best pool company in San Diego. Call them. You need to have them out. Thank you. All right. So, uh, Greg, what do you have in Cantor's Corner? Well, quickly, I wanted to talk about the importance of ventilation in crawl spaces and attic spaces. Um, not only does ventilation provide cleaner air in your home, it makes your home cooler, which is more energy efficient. And also, you need continual air movement so that mold and mildew doesn't um, grow which can be a health hazard. It's a very inexpensive upgrade. And um, I, again, I highly recommend the, having good ventilation. All right, that sounds good. Good tips. Uh, check us out tomorrow morning on ABC 10 for the Approved Home Pro Show. See the faces behind the voices and learn some great information. That's tomorrow morning at 11 a.m. on ABC 10. Absolutely. It's going to be a great show. you got to tune into it. We've got a bunch of great things you're going to learn, you're going to see. Um, Greg, you have a Cancer's Corner coming up on that show, uh, I right. believe, as well. 
And if somebody wants to reach uh, Greg and Murray Lampert, 619-500-9485, you got any questions and, or help with it. Or MurrayLampert.com. MurrayLampert.com.